have to say congratulations. You were nominated for two Grammys. And um, I also, I also have to say, I am outraged that you were not nom nominated for album of the year or song of the year. That how shape, I cannot believe that that was not nominated for, sh for song of the year. I mean. I think, do you know, like uh, my, my way of my like outlook on it is like, it's just some, some years you have your year and some years you don't have your, your year and maybe this year isn't my year. It, well, that song, I mean, it did, did not leave my head. I mean, ever. But that's, but, but that's the point, that's, that's where you win. That's where the validation comes from, where you actually see people, genuine people enjoying the songs and stuff like that. Yeah, and, you know, yeah. Like, yeah. So like, okay. I'd, rather, I'd rather have like a lifetime of people coming up to me of saying like, this song affects me in this way, in a positive way, and like this song's like my wedding song, this song was my first kiss, than you know, anything else. I think that's right. where the validation comes well, from. Well, you're a very, so thank you. you're a very uh, well-adjusted person. <laughs> um, <laughs> so, uh, and Perfect, the song that you just did, is, you said that's your favorite song? Yeah, yeah Why it is. Why is that? Um, do you know what, it was, it, it was like one of the fastest songs that I'd written and had just kind of come out and, uh, it was the first song I wrote for the album, and I'm still not really like sick of it. I still listen to it and, and like it. And we're putting out a remix tonight with Beyonce. It's just come out. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Which is uh, exciting. Um, which is one of those things, like, I kind of like, I did it, and the song came out so long ago uh, in the scheme of like music now, like music kind of goes so fast. And I was like, I want to do it as a single. And then I thought of a way of relaunching it. And, you know, I was like, well, I, I love Beyonce, shall I ask Beyonce? And then in my head I was like, she's gonna say no. And then I was like, well, you might as well ask. And she said, yeah. So wow, that's gonna be amazing. Yeah. And is it about your girlfriend? It is, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm so happy that you're happy. So you, you've been with your girlfriend for how long now? Almost three years. That's fantastic. Almost three years. I'm yeah, very we went, happy for you. We went to high school together. Yeah. She's, uh, I know. Um, yeah, she's really cool. We, uh, we live together, we have cats. Uh, <laughs> They're really cool. Um, we just got a Christmas tree, put that up. How many like, cats like, do you have? Got two cats, but like, they're both really, really, really strange creatures. <laughs> Why? Um, I don't know, it's kind of like they don't have any, like, they do have ribs, but they kind of sit like humans, like this. They'll sit up like this that's with their legs. Like, it's really strange. Like, that's you're adorable. They'll just be looking at you like that. That's. Yeah. You need to, are you, are you Instagramming them? Because that's yeah, yeah, actually have, really yeah, funny. Yeah, they I'm, should have their own Instagram account. They should. Yeah, yeah, they should. What are their names? Calippo and Dorito. Well, that's why. You've Dor named them. Dorito's got like little orange Doritos. Uh huh. Yeah. yeah. And then, uh, yeah. And that's the other weird. one? Oh, man, I don't really well, know. Calippo in England is uh, um, uh, an ice cream, like an ice, like iced Icy pop. flavored thing. Yeah. Yeah. Pop, ice pop. Yeah. So, yeah, I thought I'd call it that. Um, hey, tell me what happened to you. Uh, I saw pictures of you with broken arms and things. What happened? Uh, I was cycling to the pub. It was my. Uh, you were on your way to the pub, yeah, not yeah. on your way from the pub. No, no. This is the, <laughs> this is the weird thing, right? I was. Uh, I it was. I had two days off. I just shot the perfect video, which um, I was skiing in, and I can't ski. So if any time you're going to break your arms, I assumed it was going to be then. I just shot that, and I had two days off in between tour, and I went home, uh, and stayed at my girlfriend's parents' house, and we both got our bicycles, and we cycled to the pub, and I was going down a hill, and I braked, fell off like hit both arms but then was like it's my only day off i'm going to the pub so <laughs> <laughs> so cycled cycled to the pub drunk with all my mates then cycled home and then in the morning i was just like in so much pain that uh drove myself to the hospital uh and then they were like you can't drive back um and, the and only what, reason, what had you done you broke your arm i broke my wrist my this wrist my elbow and my rib yeah oh my god and you lasted all night long at the pub without yeah. <laughs> Well, because, like, I, I'm a quite clumsy person, so I kind of thought that I was overreacting. I was kind of like, oh, the pain will go, and then it didn't go. Yeah. yeah. Man, oh, man. Well, I'm glad you're okay. Thank you. That's horrible. Um, that's, and were you wearing a helmet? Yes. <laughs> I, do you know what? I will be wearing one from now yeah. on now since you I crashed. You should yeah. wear a bodysuit, like a kind of like, I don't know, like what people wear when they practice dogs attacking them. You should yeah. wear that. It was weird, it was weird though, because I mean, once, w once the elbow kind of got movement, uh, it was all right, but I couldn't cut my own food, wash, like open doors. Like I was really, really dependent on Cherry for like the whole thing. For how long? A at least a month, at wow. least a month. And then uh, you couldn't play guitar probably. No, I had to cancel some tour dates, which I've never done before, which wasn't 
wasn't the best thing to do, but like, yeah, I've just finished up the Asia tour though, so I know I can play guitar, and obviously I've fought yeah. today, so I'm, I'm, I'm good. You're moving around okay. Yeah.